Hey, Governor Tony Evers directed the Department of Health Services to restrict the size of all child care settings. This means child care facilities have to limit themselves to no more than 10 on-duty staff and a maximum of 50 children. Local 5's Robin Oguinye talked to child care providers and some parents about the problems these cutbacks could cause. It's a little quieter than usual at Care for All Ages Child Care Center, but there's still plenty of kids around. The center's director said coronavirus concerns have kept some children at home, but not all parents have that option. One mom called crying and the husband would have to stay home then, which is down in income, if we wouldn't be able to provide that care. I would honestly probably either leave them at home, try to find a babysitter, or normally when my kids are sick, take them to work with me. Typically, Care for All Ages serves about 160 kids a day. They're asking their staff and the parents that if they can make arrangements to stay at home for the time being, to do so. Fortunately, Care for All Ages has two parts to their facility that are completely separate from one another. The regular building and what they call a gym area. They ask permission from the state to keep both parts open. That way they can serve at least 100 kids instead of just 50. That permission was granted. But services for some children will still have to be cut. If they don't need child care, where they have an alternative or they can stay home with their kids, we're trying to get their help in this decision making because that will allow us not to have to end care for somebody who truly needs it. For now, what the center will do with its employees is unclear. Temporary layoffs are inevitable. We're also looking at if we can do like some split shifts um, because we can't have any extra staff for breaking and stuff. Maybe we can work that in somehow. Amidst the coronavirus chaos, child care providers are trying to provide some peace for parents. At least the owners at this daycare, I can honestly say, are more worried about the parents and their income and taking care of our children the best that they can. In Green Bay, Robin Oguinye, Local 5 News.